guys. Uh, meet me again in uh, my YouTube channel. The, today I would like to introduce to you. This is the old machine that I purchased uh, last night uh, for my uh, activity, not the uh, official activity, but personal activity. Uh, this is the old machine uh, around maybe 2010-2012 but now uh, this uh, machine not uh, produce anymore because the company already buy by Oracle this is Sun Oracle Sun ZFS storage 7 3220 but uh, this is a uh, no CD room but you can install the application through the USB I tried last night but I'm not installing it yet uh, in the next video I will uh, show you to the install operating system uh, on this machine in this machine I will show you also at the back, uh, at the front, you have uh, SATA or SAS uh, depending on your configuration but in this machine this is uh, using uh, SATA also I have one uh, storage here that using the SAS At the front here, uh, this is some uh, tumble on off uh, power and then LED light. At the side here, uh, it's also indicator that if you fail on the power supply, that will be indicated here. And then uh, also, uh, if you have fail on the fan, that will be indicated in here. This is on the front of uh, the server. This is one U uh, server. Uh, according to this, uh, this uh, server have four uh, network card, and the back side I will show you later on. Uh, came with the CPU uh, 5600 series uh, with two uh, two point forty gigahertz and uh, four core. Uh, the RAM uh, this is uh, maximum can be uh, put on the 144 giga uh, with the uh, maximum capacity but in this machine I have only 32 so uh, add, uh, 2 8 giga on the left side and uh, also 8 giga to dim on the right side so only 32 uh, now uh, we don't have any information that I can uh, show you. I will show you also the picture inside because it's already sealed by the store that I cannot open it uh, when I open because I also break the guarantee. Uh, now I will show you at the back of this. Uh, machine at the front I already told you that we have here uh, two USB 
that you can put your operating system to be installed in here also you can access the data through USB uh, through here uh, in, see you, uh, in the next video I will show you uh, how to install uh, the operating system through this USB now I will show you the back of this server so here we have two uh, power supply here redundant so if the one power fail you uh, the other power supply uh, will take care uh, your server uh, this one this one is also by store we have here LED indicator if you uh, something uh, if it's okay this is will light light with the green if it's something that will be light up thing with the yellow yeah and this one is a uh, server management a hundred uh, MB uh, because this is a uh, thousand mbps uh, this is net management uh, i think it's also 100 i think this is the if you have uh, uh, serial or serial cable that uh, directly to convert it to the rg45 i think using this if you want to remote uh, outside uh, office or in the office also you can use uh, net management using rg45 and this is uh, for network uh, by default uh, we have 4000 uh, mb mbit bps yeah uh, this is for and USB and also the display port and we have also three PCA here uh, this one I don't know uh, this is a uh, uh, what a kind of this port but I think this is also for network but uh, this one we have three uh, port I think this is also rg45 but i don't know uh, the speed of this but i will check later on uh, to uh, introduce to you what is this and this is blank uh, so no uh, this is a spare uh, you can uh, put here on the top of ra uh, sorry on the top of the server uh, also manual that uh, really uh, useful if you want to uh, repair something or opening something from the server okay guys uh, that's it for uh, introduce the sun storage zfs storage 7320 from Sun Oracle uh, this Oracle is came after Sun acquisition around maybe 2010 yeah so I think uh, this server is produced after uh, acquisition because this is marked by Oracle so I see last uh, on Wikipedia, this server like this is also produced in 2019. I, I don't remember that now, but I will show you the, the link of uh, Wikipedia on this uh, video. Okay, guys, that's it uh, for this video. Uh, the next video, I will show you how to put uh, from USB because we need the configuration on the BIOS first. Uh, you also need to uh, 
uh, uh, make a USB as bootable using some uh, application called Fantoy. I will show you on the next video, yeah. Okay, thank you for watching, guys. I hope this video is useful for you that you have uh, this server or you want to know the product of the Sun Microsystem or you learn something from uh, this kind of uh, machine uh, from uh, searching on the YouTube or the Google. Thank you for watching, for watching guys. Keep healthy and see you in the next video. Bye bye.